When I started in 2015, we were 220 contractors, six, seven staff members in the office. In eight years now, as it stands, we're 3,400 contractors. So we captured all of the oil and gas market. So we that was what the kingdom was focusing on when I started uh, in 2015. And now, obviously, we're diversifying according to the kingdom's vision. The economic uh, opportunity in Saudi is Tremendous. There is currently $230 billion worth of active projects in the kingdom, which is exciting to any young professional. Saudi is quite developing now that we have lots of major projects and upcoming projects also. The female are on the leadership positions. They are really doing pretty well and uh, it's, it's quite uh, you know good to see the changes over here. Saudi is amazing now. Uh, it, it, it has been uh, through, passing through uh, major transformation in the last couple of years. They have uh, uh, good projects pipeline. Uh, they have a good education system. The, the healthcare is excellent. The infrastructure is growing and becoming uh, more and more uh, better. So now it is it is a very popular place to come and stay and work and live in Saudi Arabia. In a year, I saw two really big changes. The first, uh, that we added female to the team. Uh, that I remember in the first, uh, that when I joined, we were only males in the team working here. Uh, so we can feel it. The vibe is completely different. Other than that, I would say the presence of local uh, in the company, in the office. We are having more and more Saudi national working with us and it's really helpful. Since I came to Saudi, I have seen massive changes like uh, women are excelling more and more at higher position in the companies and they have more sense of freedom in each and every aspect of their life. For instance, um, the government has announced a quota uh, to hire female candidates to increase their participation in the workforce and they also ease the travel restriction and providing multiple opportunities for their education. I think so, this change creates a massive impact on the uh, gender equality and women empowerment in the kingdom, and demonstrating the government's uh, commitment towards uh, inclusion and diversity. I started uh, with NES in 2016 as an account manager. I was promoted to senior account manager two years later, and another two late, uh, years later, I was promoted to lead account manager. Uh, NES has been great with career progression, uh, management guidance and uh, key criteria from HR software really helps you map out your performance development plan from one promotion to another. So realistically, it's like a roadmap of your career of how you want to get to the next stage and the support is always there. The sky's the limit, if I'm being very honest. So, you know, from an exact exec, you can go to account manager, you can go to a lead account manager. Uh, you can even be, become a senior manager or, or even more. You know, there's examples in the company who started as recruiters to this day they are now directors. So like that's evidence to the growth that NES will give you. When I joined, uh, one of uh, our colleagues from Dubai office come here to Khuba and she teach me about everything for one week and uh, she's like working on her weekend just to teach me about everything. My first year in NES, I started as a recruitment uh, specialist. In one year, I get promoted and I've been nominated to be one of the best new employees. I've been uh, traveled to UK to be nominated as one of the new best new employees. They, they set you up to succeed, one. They empower you, so there's no micromanagement, if you know what I mean. So they empower you to be creative, innovative. Now, it allows innovation. So like, my boss always allows me to look for solutions and and come back uh, with, uh, with different ideas and, and implement them and allowing you to have trial and error is key. At Aeneas what I have seen is like every day is a celebration over here but if I have to pick it one I would say that when I uh, came in Aeneas for the first time in Saudi office uh, there was a celebration for uh, Saudi Foundation Day where I even I tried my best to be one of them because I've just uh, wore an attire called Jalabia, which is local attire with the jewelry and everything. So I was just trying to approach as one of them and it was the best thing to do and best memory I can recall. Mostly is about the team uh, environment, the office. 
how the people are treating each other, friendly, lovely people, working together as a one team, um, how to like introduce the new people to our uh, our office here. But for me, is the teamwork and the team environment. I must say that I'm very blessed to work with such an amazing people-oriented company. One of the aspects I enjoy the most while working at NES is the opportunity to for professional development. For example, NES has multiple training programs uh, and the career advancement opportunities and providing employees with the resources and tools to excel and grow in their career. I think so it helps a lot uh, with the new candidates who are about to join NES and uh, they can excel in, in this field as well. I like the culture. They are so friendly and so supportive. Like when first I joined, everyone like introduce uh, themselves. They um, take care of each other. I feel like it's family, not work uh, place. As soon as you get in the office, you can feel the vibe is amazing. People are really supportive. They are helpful. Uh, I remember the first day that I joined in ES and I felt this vibe from the beginning. People were so welcoming, they introduced me to the whole team, they were so supportive, helping me with any questions. So this is the most, uh, I mean, I think, the, the, the thing that I prefer the, the most in, in our office. Yeah.